and we are in line 109. So it says, my life is continually in my hand. Okay, so or my life is continually in danger. <laughs> and yeah, when we have it in our hands, it is danger. All right, yet I do not forget your law. So even though his life is in danger, he's not going to forget God's law, God's teaching, God's instruction. He's not going to forget that. And we can't because, the, you know, God's word and God's law is going to help sustain us and keep us and protect us. All right, 110. Um, the wicked have laid a snare for me, yet I have not strayed from your precepts. So he's saying that the wicked have laid a snare for me, uh, yet I have not strayed from your precepts. So even though the wicked have laid a snare, you know, try to ins uh, tr entrap him. He said, I have not strayed from your precepts. And sometimes that's what people do. You know, if they're being attacked, if they've been uh, persecuted and stuff like that, that's when they run away, they stray away from God. So, no, I can't take this anymore. I'm just going back. I'm going back into the world. They can't take it. All right. So, uh, let's go to Psalm 140, line 5, for a reference scripture that says, The proud have hidden a snare for me in cords. They have spread a net by the wayside. They have set traps for me, Selah. And that's what the uh, the wicked do and the proud. They lay snares and stuff like that for people. All right. But, you know, they are what? Laying their own snares for them own selves. And so he doesn't have to uh, worry about that. 111. Your testimonies I have taken as a heritage forever. Your testimonies I have taken as a heritage forever. Or like uh, it says, uh, your testimonies I have taken as a inheritance forever. Remember uh, what ancient Hebrew said, that this is what continue or offspring. All right. And so you can see how this is tied. The meaning is tied into uh, this psalm. So it says your uh, testimonies, testimonies I have taken as a heritage forever or inheritance forever. And so that sends us to Deuteronomy 33, 4. That says, Moses commanded a law for us, a heritage of the congregation of Jacob. And so that's just to corroborate um, that. So Moses commanded a, a law for us, a heritage of the congregation of Jacob. Okie dokie. All right. And then so going back to uh, Psalm 119. So your testimonies I have taken as a heritage forever. Remember, God is his own testimony. And so he's saying that I have taken, yes, your testimonies I have taken as an inheritance. And remember, inheritance is something you get um, when someone dies. And so what he's saying is that God's testimony I have taken as a heritage. Well, it has to be forever because God is not going to die. All right, God is not going to die. And uh, so then it says, For they are the rejoicing of my heart. So the testimonies makes his heart rejoice. For they are the rejoicing of my heart. And then 112, I have inclined my heart to perform your statutes forever to the very end. So I have inclined my heart. All right, pay attention. To perform your statutes. All right. To perform them. That means to do them. Why? Because they engraved um, on on his on his mind and his in his mind and his heart. I have inclined my heart to perform your statutes when forever to the very end. And so that's what he's going to do. All right. So now now this psalm had one two. Three, four, five, six words of the Lord that um, that we looked at um, today. All right, and so uh, that's it for uh, that's uh, <laughs> that stands at noon. All right, and so we will move into our next uh, stanza. And so let me just say, keep the faith, keep the focus. God bless you, and I love you.